guys welcome back to a brand new one punch man video and my last video <laughs> my last video is apparently quite a controversial one where lots of people said nah i'm binning i'm binning this video off because i said that i didn't like the genos limit break now for those of you who watch me and understand that i don't speak normal english would understand that doesn't mean i don't like it it's just that it's annoying to get now to kind of redeem myself a little bit here his breakthrough is not trash in the sense that this is trash his actual skills are trash it's trash in the sense that you have to get it to plus seven until you get the extension now i was thinking about this the other day because obviously this video is going to be the wheel spin as you can see in the title so i was trying to think who should i try and level up and i was having a proper think about this and i was thinking i want to try and get a cat drop to plus 10 right which is going to be mad. Maybe I'll be finished by next year. I mean, I can't imagine I'm still making daily videos in this game next year, but if we don't know. I do really like this game and you guys are legends. But anyway, so means so I want I do take back what I said. And that's not because of you guys, but I was really thinking about the RNG here, right? And I was thinking that the amount of times when I'm playing Trials, Road to Strong, um what you call it uh story mode uh pvp that i've reset battles because genesis has put the wrong buff on people so i'm trying to think what character what character is going to be the most useful um to to work on golden ball's got okay breakthrough but it's not particularly great terrible tornado's got a fantastic breakthrough but once again you've got to get to level seven to really see the change because she drops another ball down but I want to get Genos upgraded here, and I want to try and get Genos level 10. Now, I know that might be mental for all of you guys who are watching. I'm not going to pay to do this. Um, I'm going to see how... I'm going to see how long it takes me to do this legit. Um, and probably cry. Or I'll probably get into plus one and be like, yeah, I can't be bothered. But I do want to get Genos up to plus seven, because I really do want that buff. And... It just... It's, and I do really like the idea that his, um, his incineration cannon is going to do splash damage. That's naughty. And what's also good here, guys, is all characters increase attack by X amount. High tech and good. So, the reason you put Genos on a team, right, is to be a, a, a buff a buff man. Huge buff, buff lord, whatever you want to say. And if you upgrade him, look. 9,000, 13,000, 18,000, 23,000, 27,000, 32,000. Each time you go up, you're going to have the attack being increased by loads. And this is what I was thinking about, right? I was looking at this and going, okay, I use Genos to every single mode to increase people's attack. But if I upgrade his breakthrough, he's going to increase people's attack by default. And then he's going to apply his buff to more people, making him ridiculous. So I am going to jump into Genos and see how, and I do generally quite actually like to use Genos. I do need to um, I would like to get some gear on him to bring his attack up, especially now his special is going to be doing a lot more. So I will be keeping my eye out to buying some swords from the store so I can try and get him upgraded with attack as well. And if you put him in the middle column, guys, and you use incineration cannon and it splits off onto all the other rows, it's going to be ridiculous. So I'm going to spin this wheel and all of the breakthrough I get is going to go onto Genos. Now, for those of you arguing with me saying, Oh, Terrible Tornado would be better. Yes, Terrible Tornado's breakthrough is good. This is the point, guys. This is the reason they brought the breakthrough mode out. Because everybody's breakthrough is good. And it's impossible to level up. And obviously they do it so you spend loads. But I was looking at hers, right? I was looking at hers and I was trying to decide, okay, what what is actually better? Now, I understand this increases critical damage by 30% and it drops another boulder. But all it does is increase it by 1%. So, I get to plus 7, then I might as well bin it off. Because it, there's, I don't, I'm not fussed about the critical damage. It's just the boulders are coming down increasing, which is fantastic. So, I guess my real struggle is, who do I, I, I'm, I'm putting this question out to you guys. Whose breakthrough should I get to plus 10 first? Should it be Turbo Tornadoes? Or should it be Genesis? That's what I'm putting towards you guys. It's going to be one of those two. And I, I will do a poll on my channel, but guys, comment down below and let me know who you think, whose breakthrough I think I should use. Because this is one of the most, not I wouldn't say complicated, but the most strenuous thing in this game 
is trying to get people's breakthroughs upgraded because it's so difficult to do how can you maintain all of these characters at the same time is it better to get them more to plus one i don't know but guys comment down your opinions because i noticed it was quite a controversial topic which i quite liked that we were all discussing what people think about breakthroughs so just keep that going and you comment down below and let me know what you guys think of breakthroughs should you do plus one to characters should you get them to plus 10 let me know so let's spin the wheel i'm not going to use the breakthrough shard straight away but i do have 132 beautiful spins so with this, obviously, I hope I get something good. I'm probably not. I mean, I could land on that 10 times, but I probably won't. Okay, let's go. So I dedicate this to Oni. Because last time I said his name, I got something really good. Here we go. Spin. Ooh, I got... I, okay, 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 okay. I did get 10 purple shards, two breakthroughs, loads of the kernels. Not bad for a first one. Not bad for a first one. Here we go again. Oh, that's nowhere near as good. That's nowhere near as good, unfortunately. And again. Oh, you just think all of this hard work. <laughs> and you're always, always given trash. Let's go again. No. No. Right, give me luck. Jonas, give me luck now. This is an honour of Jonas, this one. Come on, this this is just this this is unacceptable. I'm gonna say it, guys. Oh, oh, six shards there. Ten more break. Oh, one summon as well. Five more. Oh, a few more kernels there. Oh, three more breakthrough shards. I shouldn't be getting excited at three. I should not be getting excited. Maybe if I show the game an apple, it will give me good luck. Right, okay, now that's summoning me for good luck. Two, two more. Oh my god. Come on. I, I never I never get lucky on these um wheel spins. This is the one event which always tickles me. I don't have words. I do not have words to describe how rubbish that was that was very very painful um i don't think i can get any more actually oh i i can to be fair if i do my dailies i think i can do one more time send spin um not particularly excited uh because of how badly that all went um but let's let's spam my dailies quickly and get that last times 10 spin Right, let's see how quickly I can do my dailies. I remember I did that competition. You guys were smashing the daily missions out. I think before my game lagged an absolute treat, I was able to do like all my dailies in about a minute. Uh, claim more missions. We still have, oh, we still have double. We still have double on the missions. All right. Come on. I didn't get lucky in my wheel spins. But let's see if I can get lucky with a couple of resets here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Give me something good here. Come on, give me the thousand. Ooh, 80 shards. That's good. I need so many purple shards. I wish I'd used my purple shards on upgrading um, uh, Mosquito Girl instead of that rubbishy character. Instead of Sky King. I don't know why I did that. That was just a, that was dumb. That was dumb on my behalf. Um, I wish you could reset him back to like... Can you do that? I don't think you can. Because if you reset him, it doesn't bring him down his rank. Because if so, I would just I would ditch every single one of that character shards. Because I just I dislike him. Because <laughs> if if I recycle, um, I I, yeah, I I didn't think it worked. I don't think it worked like that. When you own two same characters whose rank are above elite plus, the one with the lowest rank can be yeah. I can't do that. Ah, oh, we, we, we make mistakes, guys, but. That's a big one. 
Oh, that's a big one. He's absolute trash. He's absolute trash. Um, to be fair, he's not trash. Because if you can get his special mode move out correctly, I've seen him mad. I see him do some mad stuff. Um, I wonder what shards I've got left. Let's let's just open 16. I'm not going to do that yet. I've only got 6. I always like to save until I've got about 10 to do that for a video. Um, oh yeah, I was, doing, I was doing my daily missions, but I also got... I distracted myself as I do whenever I do any type of video, guys. So, I'm obviously still undecided on who's break for I want to work on. So, guys, do make sure you drop some comments down below. And, obviously, let me know your opinions on that. And we can kind of go from there. Guys, we absolutely crushed the Guild Wars yesterday. Honestly, our guild is... Um, we're, kind of, we're kind of turning the guild around a little bit. Um, I'm making it a little bit more focused towards uh, guild battles. And just, just make it a little bit more serious. Nothing too mental. But it's all going very well. I think we only lost by, like, a very small amount of points as well. Ooh! 500. Banging. That was banging. I know, guys, we, we smashed it. Uh, to be honest, if you win or lose, I don't really care, guys. No hard feelings. Just enjoy the game. That's all I can say. Because if you're not enjoying the game, there's no point in playing it. So I'm not putting stress on people. But... You know, let's focus on wins. Let's focus on wins, but if we don't win, who cares? So I, I need to I need to buy some swords from in here. So let's see if I can get a sword for Genos. See, now it's now the same thing that's gonna happen was when I wanted that one thing for King and I could never find it. I I'm as soon as I see the sword for Genos, I'm gonna buy it and try and spin it onto him so I can get a really good gear set for Genos, guys. Really good push for Genos there. Which I'm quite excited for. When does this reset? 25 days, that's annoying. Okay, so and then guys, do make sure you comment down below. Whose breakthrough should I get to plus 10 first? Should it be TT's or should it be Genesis? Let me know what you think, guys, because I really do want to see how long it would take to try and push someone's breakthrough, kind of being semi-pay to win and semi-free to play. So I kind of want to know, guys. So, oh, actually, I need to get my last 10, don't I? Come on. Oh, people want to loan my characters. Who have we got today? Who have we got today? Come on. E lovely. Take them all. Get rid of them. I don't need them. Take my characters away. Take my beautiful characters away. Yes, I've got that guy's triple staff lily now as well, which is great. Um, and I will go into the extreme trials. And then I can do, I think this will give me one more, one more times 10 spin. Which, I, I am scared. I'll be honest with you, I am very scared about doing my times 10 spin. Because I would love another 100 here. So if I got another 100, I'd probably be able to get um, TT up a few more times. But let's let's take a look. Okay. I haven't really used TT for a while, though. That's kind of my thing. 10. <sighs> oh, that's just... That's insulting. See, the problem is, without buying loads and loads of gift packs... I'm not going to get anywhere good. But guys, if you are going to buy some gift packs, do make sure you click that top link in description, guys. Jump over to Huawei and get cheaper in-app purchases and cash back, which means free in-app purchases. Do that, guys. Help support the channel. Smash that like and subscribe button. And I'll see you legends in the next one.